Introducing the GRI Sector Standards. Focusing reporting on the issues that matter most. The world is facing many challenges, including climate change, biodiversity loss, poverty, and inequality, which require urgent action from all of us. To address these challenges, organizations in a sector which share many common activities and impacts must focus on the issues that matter most. Sustainability reporting by individual companies has fallen short of addressing these challenges and the information needs and expectations of stakeholders. Higher quality and comparable sustainability reporting within sectors is therefore required to increase transparency and accountability. GRI has responded to this need with the GRI Sector Standards, which address a sector's most significant impacts on the economy, environment, and people. Sector standards work alongside the Universal Standards 2021, which apply to all organizations, regardless of their sector, and the Topic Standards, which contain disclosures for reporting on areas like occupational health and safety, biodiversity, and waste. Here's how sector standards work. An organization uses the standard that applies to its sector. In the introduction to each sector standard, there's a list of types of organizations it applies to, along with information on how to use it. The next section gives an overview of the sector's activities, types of business relationships, and context, which are critical for identifying actual and potential impacts. The main section covers likely material topics, outlining the topics that are likely to be material for organizations in the sector and potentially merit reporting. These topics represent the sector's most significant impacts and have been identified based on available evidence, authoritative international instruments, and the recommendations of a multi-stakeholder expert group. Organizations reporting in accordance with the GRI standards review each topic in this section and determine whether it's material for them. Organizations need to determine their material topics according to their own specific circumstances, such as business model, ownership structure, and geographic, cultural, and legal operating context. Sector standards support an organization in their materiality process, ensuring they consider all topics that have been identified as likely material for their sector. Next, organizations determine what to report. For each topic, the sector standard includes a list of disclosures. These disclosures have been identified as relevant for organizations in the sector to report on. Most of the disclosures listed come from GRI topic standards. For the detail of these disclosures, you go to the corresponding standard to find all of the requirements and useful guidance. For example, to report on Disclosure 413-1, you need to go to GRI 413 Local Communities and check the content of the disclosure. If any of the topic standards disclosures are not relevant to the organization's impacts, they do not have to be reported. Reporting for each likely material topic may also include additional sector recommendations and disclosures. These have been identified as relevant for organizations because of the sector's impacts and are encouraged but not required. A few more things. Every organization using the GRI standards needs to publish a GRI content index. This index provides an overview of the reported information, identifies where it can be found, and helps users access this information. Sector standard reference numbers are included in each sector standard to make sure this process is easy for both reporting organizations and information users. The content index is also the place where organizations need to explain why any topics or disclosures in the sector standard are not being reported on. By introducing sector standards, GRI is helping organizations clarify their reporting expectations. We're also helping stakeholders and information users, including investors, governments, civil society, and academics, to assess and engage with organizations' reports. The process we've described applies to organizations reporting in accordance with the GRI Standards 2021. All these organizations will be required to use the applicable sector standard when the standard for their particular sector becomes available. 
In the long term, this will provide enhanced and comparable sustainability information within sectors, driving targeted action, improved decision-making, and a new era of transparency. For more than 20 years, GRI has been providing global standards for sustainability reporting, providing a common language for organizations to communicate their impacts on the environment, the economy, and people. Find out more by visiting globalreporting.org.